today it doesn't seem like there's like a lot of stuff that really gets done by hand anymore. Um, people are real, real used to getting things, you know, with a flick of a switch. De Segals, uh was opening up a new store in Manhattan. They came up with a concept to blanket the facade of this building with uh, a bunch of splashes of really bright colors. They contacted us to uh, execute the, the production work for it. Uh, we don't use computers here at all. Uh, that's kind of like what makes what we do interesting and, and uh, it's an organic approach. Everything that we do is, is done, done with our own two hands. What may have been, you know, like a quick splash of color from, you know, the initial artist's point of view, we have to really, like, deconstruct and put together because what may have been, like, a six-inch splatter to him is, to us, like, a six-foot splatter. We rely on, you know, uh, our hands and uh, we rely on one another to kind of, you know, communicate uh, what we are trying to convey to the public. I feel like, you know, what we do works really well uh, or works hand in hand with their approach you know they they have like a, a really uh, creative organic piece of artwork that they came up with and I feel like it wouldn't have been uh, executed right or believable had it been done any other way there's traffic everywhere there's people everywhere there's just these giant buildings everywhere and, you know, they took this nondescript small building on the corner of this, the street that you probably wouldn't notice and just covered it in color. I think that uh, people really enjoy seeing us approach the, you know, this, this, this sort of thing the way we do. The first thing that everybody's going to see when they're on that corner is that building. And it's just, it's the focal point now of the neighborhood. And it's just really interesting and it's different and it's, it's really cool. This is what I see.